हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वी आर डूइंग चैप्टर नंबर 16 मेंशुरेशन एक्सरसाइज 16.3 इन टुडेज वीडियो वी विल स्टार्ट फ्रॉम क्वेश्चन नंबर 13 क्वेश्चन 13 इज द सम ऑफ डायमीटर्स ऑफ टू सर्कल इज 14 सेंटीमीटर एंड द डिफरेंस ऑफ देयर सरकमफेरेंसेस इज 8 सेंटीमीटर फाइंड द सरकमफेरेंसेस ऑफ द टू सर्कल सो फर्स्ट वी विल टेक लेट द रेडियस ऑफ फर्स्ट सर्कल इज r1 एंड द रेडियस ऑफ सेकंड सर्कल इज r2 सो लेट radius of first circle is r1 and radius of second circle is r2 so now we will frame the equation according to the question diameter of two circle for diameter means double of radius means 2 r1 plus 2 r2 is equal to 14 2 we can take out common and r1 plus r2 will be inside the bracket equal to 14. 2 we can shift another side so we will get r1 plus r2 is equal to 7. This is our first equation. Second thing they have given the difference of their circumferences. Means circumference of first circle if I will take c1 minus circumference of another circle is equal to 8. Circumference of first circle means 2 pi r1 and this is 2 pi r2 equal to 8. 2 pi we can take out common r1 minus r2 is equal to 8 or r1 minus r2 is equal to 8 upon 2 pi or 4 upon pi. This is our second equation. Now these two equations we have to solve. Pi value also we can substitute here. We can write R1 minus R2 is equal to 4 upon 22 by 7. 2, 2 and 2, 11. So, 14 upon 11. This is our second equation. Now, if we add these two equation. Adding equation 1 and 2. We will get R1 plus R1. We will get 2 R1 r2 minus r2 it will cancel out and right side 7 plus 14 upon 11 take lcm 2 r1 is equal to 77 plus 14 upon 11 or 2 r1 is equal to 91 upon 11 or r1 is equal to 91 upon 22 this is the value of r1 this value we can substitute in the second equation. From equation 1 or 2, any one equation you can take from equation 1. 91 upon 22 plus R2 is equal to 7. So, R2 is equal to 7 minus 91 upon 22. Again take LCM 154 minus 91 upon 22, 63 upon 22. This is the value of R2. And here we have to find out the circumferences of two circle means C1 and C2. So therefore C1 is equal to 2 pi R1, 2 into 22 by 7 and R1 value is 91 upon 22. 7 13 times and 22 we can cancel out 2 into 13 26 centimeter second circumference will be 2 pi r2 2 into 22 by 7 into 63 upon 22 22 will cancel out 7 9 just 16 3 and 2 into 9 18 centimeter next we have question number 14 Find the circumference of the circle whose area is equal to the sum of the areas of 3 circles with radius 2 cm, 3 cm and 6 cm. So here let the radius of the big circle which we are getting after adding these 3 circles is equal to r cm. Now according to the question they have given the area of this bigger circle. If I will denote it with capital A this is equal to the area of first circle plus area of second circle plus area of third circle 
this circle area formula will be pi r square this will be pi and radius is 2 for second one radius is 3 and for the third one radius is 6 so r1 r2 r3 pi r square pi we can take out common and here we'll get 2 square plus 3 square plus 6 square pi we can shift another side and it will cancel out and here we'll get 4 plus 9 plus 36 so r square we are getting equal to 49 therefore r value is equal to 7 centimeter and we have to find out its circumference circumference will be 2 pi r 2 into 22 by 7 into 7 7 will cancel out 2 into 22 44 centimeter Next, we have question number 15. A copper wire when bent in the form of a square encloses an area of 121 cm square. If the same wire is bent into the form of circle, find the area of the circle. So, here the square and the circle are from the same wire. It means the circumference of the circle and perimeter of the square will be same. So, first we will find out the perimeter of a square with the help of given area. So area of a square is given 121 centimeter square area of a square means side square is equal to 121 side square is equal to 11 square so one side of square will be 11 centimeter perimeter of a square will be 4 into side 4 into 11 44 centimeter this 44 centimeter will be the circumference of the circle therefore circumference is equal to 44 centimeter circumference means 2 pi r is equal to 44 2 into 22 by 7 into r is equal to 44 so r value will be 44 into 7 upon 2 into 22 22 2 is a and 2 also we can cancel out so r we are getting 7 centimeter so therefore area of circle will be pi r square pi value is 22 by 7 r is 7 into 7 7 we can cancel out so 22 into 7 will be 154 centimeter square Next we have question number 16. A copper wire when bent in the form of an equilateral triangle has area 121 root 3 cm square. If the same wire is bent into the form of a circle, find the area enclosed by the wire. So first area of triangle is given with the help of that we can find out the perimeter of triangle. Perimeter of triangle will be the circumference of the circle and with the circumference we can find out the area of the circle. So, we have to find out here area enclosed by the wire means area of the circle. So, peri, uh, area of triangle is given. One twenty one root three centimeter square. Area of equilateral triangle will be root three by four a square, which is equal to one twenty one root three. So, a square will be one twenty one root 3 into 4 upon root 3 this we can cancel out so a square will be 11 square and 2 square or a will be 11 into 2 22 centimeter so perimeter of triangle will be because it is an equilateral triangle so all the three side will be 22 only we will get 66 centimeter this will be the circumference of circle 66 centimeter so circumference is 2 pi r is equal to 66 2 into 22 by 7 into r is equal to 66 so r value we will get 66 into 7 upon 2 into 22 21 upon 2 centimeter now we have to find out the area of circle. 
so therefore area of circle will be pi r square 22 by 7 into 21 upon 2 into 21 upon 2 with the 2 you can cancel out 7 also you can cancel out after multiplication 693 upon 2 we will get or we can write in the decimal next we have question number 17 a part find the circumference of the circle whose area is 16 times the area of circle with diameter 7 centimeter so here we are having two circles the area of big circle is 16 times the area of another circle for this big circle area will be pi r square and taken its radius is capital R for the small circle area is pi r square small r for this small circle diameter is given 7 centimeter so therefore radius will be half of diameter means 7 by 2 centimeter so pi r square equal to 16 pi 7 upon 2 whole square pi we can cancel out from both the side when you will shift it will cancel out and this you can write 16 into 49 upon 4 4 4 the 16 we can cancel out and this we can write 2 square into 7 square so r will be 2 into 7 14 centimeter we have to find out its circumference so therefore circumference is equal to 2 pi r 2 into 22 by 7 into 14 equal to 88 centimeter next we have question number 17 b part in the given figure find the area of the unshaded portion within the rectangle take pi is equal to 3.14 so here this figure is given in the question in this figure we have two and a half circles which are shaded inside this rectangle so for this rectangle length will be 15 because here to here it is 3 then again 3 3 3 and 3 5 times 3 it means 15 and breadth will be here to here it will be 3 and here to here 3 means 6 centimeter so length is 15 breadth is 6 centimeter so area of unshaded part we have to find out so area of unshaded part will be area of this rectangle minus area of these circles so area of unshaded part is equal to area of rectangle minus area of two and a half circles area of rectangle is length into breadth and this two and a half you can take at the starting and area of circle is pi r square length is 15 breadth is 6 two and a half means 5 by 2 pi value we have to take 3.14 r is 3 so with 2 we can cancel 2 1 ja, 5 ja and 7 ja, 15 6 ja, 90 and these numbers we have to multiply after multiplication we will get 70.65 so subtract and then we are getting 19.35 centimeter square so area of unshaded part will be 19.35 centimeter square next we have question number 18 in the given figure ABCD is a square of 21 centimeter AC and BD are two diameters of the square uh, two semicircles are drawn with AD and BC as diameter find the area of the shaded part and take pi value equal to 22 by 7 so this figure is given in the question in this figure this square is divided by these two diagonals so this square is dividing into four equal part two triangles we have taken as the shaded part so two triangles means half of this square and one semicircle here one semicircle here so it means half semicircle half circle half circle means one circle so area of shaded part will be area of circle two semicircles if we add it will become a complete circle plus half area of a square 
area of circle will be pi r square and area of square will be psi d square. Pi value is 22 by 7 r. This total is given 21. So r will be half of this. This is the diameter. So radius will be 21 by 2. Plus half side of this square is 21. 21 square. 7, 3 you can cancel out. 2, 11 times you can cancel out. 11 into 3 into 21 will be 693 upon 2. Here 21 square will be 441 upon 2. Add these after addition 1134 upon 2. After division we will get 567 centimeter square. So in this video we are doing till here. Remaining questions we will continue in the next video. Thank you for watching this video.